Welcome and congratulations. Arriving here in this unique arrangement wasn't easy. For us to exist here, pulsating with life, brimming with sentience, upright and vital, is a marvel in itself. And somehow, trillions of drifting itinerant atoms have assembled into a breathtakingly complex and beautiful, elegant pattern to create you. This peculiar and unique arrangement, this fundamental unus, is so specialised and precise that it has never been tried before and never will be again. Every atom you possess has almost certainly passed through several stars and millions of organisms on its way to arriving here tonight. But your atoms don't care about this. They're mindless particles, not in themselves alive. And yet, for around 650,000 hours, their purpose is to keep you, you. Tonight is a celebration, a celebration of existence, a celebration of this astounding atomic journey. Each of the songs you will hear are the destinations, and the atoms are the fragments that connect our stories. to lead other lives in other beings long after you're gone. The beauty of a living thing is not the atoms that go into it, but the way those atoms are put together.
If you wish to make an apple pie from scratch, you must first invent the universe.
way home Hand in hand we go Is this the way home? The way home Hand in hand we go Is this the way home? The way home Hand in hand we go There's as many atoms in a single molecule of your DNA as there are stars in a typical galaxy.
Thank you. 
fire in your heart and butterflies in your stomach. These are but atoms formed as chemicals designed to bring your unique arrangement of atoms towards another. A lover, a partner, a beautiful, funny, annoying, caring, confusing, unique arrangement of atoms. With a dollop of dove meat and a dash of oxytocin and a sprinkle of serotonin, our atoms can come together and fall in love. Except for hydrogen, all the atoms that make each of us up, the iron in our blood, the calcium in our teeth, the nitrogen in our DNA, the carbon in our apple pies, were manufactured in the interiors of collapsing stars, thousands of miles away in space.
of this space, in our atoms, humans are nearly nothing. The entire human race would fit into the volume of a sugar cube. The rest is empty space, nearly nothing. <laughs> I am made of seven octillion atoms, give or take a few. Astronomical numbers for anatomical me. Seven octillion little buddies running around in perpetual motion. When they are but a short distance apart, they attract. Mm -hmm. too close together and they are repelled. They push each other away. Yet all of these atoms are still just me attracting and repelling. I am a whole universe of atoms and yet I am only a tiny part of an ever expanding universe which the more it expands the lonelier those atoms
Humans have evolved to wonder.
of sea, of liquid. But look how far we have come. Look how much we can change. Liquid can't write a book. Liquid can't fall in love. Liquid can't play the sousaphone. We can even walk our atoms over to each other and make friends. We can create. We can work as a team. We can join together and we can make a much greater sum than the total of our atoms. self-awareness, star stuff pondering the stars.
star stuff making up my atoms. Star stuff hardening my teeth. Star stuff flowing round my arteries. Star stuff joining the stars to me. Your last death is that moment sometime in the future when your name is spoken for the very last time.
justice lies. Who flutter for a day and think it is forever. Wanderers, and we are wanderers still.